Okay, on to the next page. I found this paper, and it says Discover, and it looks like the board at the airport. I thought that was kind of cool. It's got World Traveler, not that we're World Travelers. I have this paper that came from EP 6x, oh, it's Echo Park, um, paper pad for getaway, and it has the airplane on it. And I thought, well, that's kind of cool. So I've already backed it on that one. Um, that's my ugly mug. This is my husband. We had a lot of time after we were all checked in, bright and early, to just sit and wait. You do what you're supposed to and then... <laughs> So I want to kind of leave the Discover and a little bit of that. I thought I had printed off what the from my phone, but I guess I didn't. This is what it looked like outside the airport when we were sitting there waiting. The phone on or my radar on my phone did not look good. There was a lot of storms. We were flying into. Minnesota, and there was a lot of storms there. I was a little worried. I'm a rare, but we made it. Um, guess I'll put that there. I might not be able to keep all of it, what I wanted to, but I don't like that. Like I've said, I'm a simple scrapbooker. I don't do anything fancy unless I just have one picture. But I try to make use of all the page and get all the pictures I can to share my memories. And I don't mind that those touch like that. Um, I have found a few things. I think I'll put that there. I have these, but I don't think they're going to show that much. This is from Freckled Fawn. It's some arrows with like maps and stuff. Maybe I'll stick one down here below. I did the Freckled Fawn sale too a few weeks ago. Just love all this stuff. I think I like the wrapper just as much as I do the product. I always like hearing them open. <laughs> so, let's see. We want one with a map. This is just showing that we're... It doesn't show up very well. I'll find a clear one and that'll be... A little bit lighter color so we'll just stick that there um, these were from a 12 by 12 pad this was a sheet of paper I just tore apart some of the tags I thought they were kind of cool that would work for the cruise I'm just fussy cutting that. Right now my pictures are kind of, or my embellishments are kind of blah, but once I get going it'll, I've got stuff that'll work. I guess the, pa the paper itself tells a lot, so I don't need a whole lot. But come fly with me. I do have another. Yeah. And this is how I scrapbook. I just kind of pick and choose what I think will work. I did find this jet set. Nah.
<laughs> ha! Let's go on an adventure. Since we're starting the adventure, that works perfect. kind of brings the color and it kind of matches. I'm not big on matching, but sometimes I like it to match a little. need a string and a tag but this just calls for it just needs it looks like it needs it you know you put your luggage tags on your suitcase so <clears throat> and I probably made it too short to pull it out That ain't gonna work. I'll make it a little longer. But I will save that piece. I need one of those threaders that when you're sewing. I don't sew on my paper. I don't sew in real life for clothes. I'm not sewing on paper. There. That's about as much sewing as I'll do. I think it looks like he's saying comply with me. This is the second time I've flown. Very proud of myself. I went, did it again. I was going to put a title something like Bright and Early, or not Bright and Early. Um, yeah, Bright and Early, and then put some Z's on it. But I think it's got the Discover. So I don't think I really need a whole lot more because the page basically tells itself. This was traveling paper too, so. Okay. That's that page. One more done. I did go back over the page and I outlined the Discover with a Sharpie marker. It just didn't look like it. It just was hidden in the page. And this brought out the word Discover a lot more. So I, and I did outline the arrows at the bottom. So I hope you enjoy this video. Please like and subscribe if you've done and come back to see more videos.